Congratulations, class of 2020. You are the first class to graduate virtually. You are facing a challenge no other class has had to face before. I have faith that you will meet this challenge with grace, dignity, and above all else, love for humanity. Best wishes to you and your future endeavors. Congratulations, you did it! Hello, class of 2020, Ms. Yamas here. I'm just here to say congratulations and wish you a great bright future. I know things are scary right now, so celebrate, but stay home, stay safe. A new day will come and you will be all right. So congratulations, all the best to you uh, from all of us here at Southgate. We miss you guys. Bye-bye. Congratulations, class of 2020, especially to my homeroom and also my Mandarin class students. It has been so wonderful working with you. I wish you all the best. Life full of fun and challenges too. Enjoy what's ahead. Keep learning, never give up. Please remember, you can do it. Ciao, Bobby. to wish the class of 2020 a really, really happy graduation. I'm gonna miss you guys, whether I know you from homeroom or Miss Reina's class or Spanish class or I worked with you. You guys collectively are a bunch of really wonderful kids and I know that you're gonna do really great in life. Come back and visit, um, come say what's up after all this is over with, okay? Once around, always around. Uh, 2020, Southgate Rams, awesome. You're uh, finally graduating and moving on to more distance learning. All right, congratulations again. Awesome job. Class of 2020, woo! Yeah. Class of 2020, you did it. Congratulations. My seniors, it was such an honor to work with all of you. And as Henry David Thoreau once said, go confidently in the direction of your dreams. Live the life you have imagined. Graduating class of 2020, I want to wish you guys the best. Congratulations. Go mighty, mighty ram. Go, go, go out and do some great things, guys. Love you. Class of 2020, usually I go to your graduation. Not going to happen this year. So to all of you, if you and I loved each other, congratulations. If you and I tolerated each other, congratulations. If I annoyed you to no end, I'm so sorry. But today, at your graduation, that's the triumph. Everyone, I love you. Congratulations. I want to say congratulations to all the seniors graduating. Um, and a special shout out to my students that I've had these past few years. Félicitations, je suis très très fière et bonne chance avec tous vos buts et vos rêves. Hello class of 2020, I want to congratulate you for your accomplishment. You graduated and you're on your way to discovering what the future holds for you. I know that whatever you go, you will represent your Southgate family with honor because once a ram, always a ram. Congratulations! Hello to all. Just wanted to say it was a pleasure having you in my class. It was an honor watching you grow as a student and as a person. Wishing you the best in your future endeavors, whatever you may choose them to be. Congratulations to the class of 2020 and may you always prosper. Southgate High School Rams, class of 2020. A big shout out. Congratulations from Gatchel. Look, you guys are his historical class. You've been through the largest teacher strike last year and you supported us second to none. We've been through a pandemic, distance learning, online learning, you call it what you want, but you did it and you did it right. And I would like to take this opportunity to congratulate you on your achievements, to wish you the absolute best future ever. And know this, once a ram, always a ram, and you've got my support wherever you may go. Take care, we love you, virtual hug, and go Rams.
Hello, Southgate. Class of 2020, this is Rick Renry, a manager of the Chicago White Sox. Just want to say congratulations and way to go. I am also a former 1980 grad, so keep going. Anything is possible. Congratulations. What's up, Southgate High School? This is Kenny Young here, linebacker for the Los Angeles Rams. Listen, class of 2020 grads, I just want to say congratulations. You guys are working hard. You deserve it. You're going to reach this whole new chapter of life where you have to learn, continue to grow, continue to inspire. I wish nothing but the best for you guys. Unfortunately for the pandemic, you guys couldn't go out the way you guys wanted to, but I'm sure with family and friends and great teachers and a great principal that you guys all had the support you needed to get through this time. And uh, once around, always around. Hey, you guys, this is Will Farrell with a shout out to the graduating class of 2020 Southgate High School, home of the Rams. You guys, you did it. You graduated. We are very excited for you. <laughs> Woo! family and friends and welcome to the Southgate High School virtual graduation. I'd like to thank all of you for joining us today uh, in a different, different light of our graduation for the class of 2020. Congratulations class of 2020, you made it. Uh, we'd like to kick off these ceremonies with some great, great speakers today. Uh, we'd like to thank all of you who are here today witnessing our first virtual, virtual graduation for Southgate High School. Okay. At this time, I'd like to introduce a very, very special guest that I chose to speak today. He is a young man who really embodies Revive the Pride. I am excited to have him today. The young man is named Angel Gonzalez. Angel has been accepted to Grand Canyon University, and his ma major is biomedical engineering. So at this time, we give a warm welcome to Angel Gonzalez, who will kick off our virtual graduation ceremony. Come on up, Angel. Good evening, parents, staff, admin, friends, and family, and especially the class of 2020. Before I begin with my speech, I was simply like to speak for myself and the class of 2020 to acknowledge Mr. Gonzalez, Mr. Vasquez, Mr. Santos, and our APs and the additional staff for making this possible and being alongside us during this pandemic. Even during these complicated times, you guys were always working and trying to plan things for us every day, constantly keeping us updated. Thank you, and I will forever be grateful for whatever for what's have what's been done. Being part of a big graduating class at Southgate High School, I was very fortunate enough to be your friend or meet a majority of you all. Many of us met during elementary years, middle school years, or even now, high school. It's been a crazy journey knowing you all. It feels as if yesterday was the first day of freshman year, and here we are now, graduating. Seniors, we didn't get the experience to say goodbye to the school properly, or didn't get the experience to say, I went to prom, or that. Prom and grad night will forever be the best memories I made in high school. I don't know how to explain the thought or how I'm feeling right now, speaking to you all. I'm sad, mad, man, I just want to feel selfish for once because I deserve all those memories just like you all. But here's one thing. Class of 2020 will always be remembered as the best class at Southgate High School, no matter what. Whether we were the best class who brought back the spirit or the class that didn't finish off their senior year. We will always be remembered. I mean, can we talk about senior day? That morning seeing you all get ready for senior day, I knew that was going to be the event that would start off our senior year amazing. And guess what? It did. The feeling I had seeing you all participate felt so crazy. I had so many butterflies that day because how amazing it was. The love, the fun, the memories we had, I wish I could relive that day so many times because of how much fun we had. These were the moments I waited for in my senior years, and I'm glad I cherished these memories with you all. But also, can we talk about the Azalea Bowl? That senior section will always be the best, especially with the powder we had. Sorry, Vasquez and Gonzalez, but if we had to have powder, it's tradition how you guys say. That night was the night that will always live alongside me with Senior Day Forever. We scrammed our lungs out that day so much that I had red powder all over my, my mouth. It was the worst, by the way. We were united and enjoying the night we've waited for since freshman year. 
But most of all, I'm going to miss doing the renegade in class and dancing in the middle of the hallways. <laughs> Just kidding. No, but in all seriousness, I love doing TikToks in class and in lunch. If you know, you know. I would like to thank Mr. Vasquez, Mr. Gonzalez, my friends, mentors, family, staff, and coordinators who were with me alongside during my high school years, and they were there for me personally. Thank you for all you've done for me, constantly keep supporting me throughout high school. Thank you, Jennifer Chavez, our senior class treasurer, Matthew Isaias, our senior class secretary, Rebecca Avila, our senior class president, and I, your senior class vice president, who are behind the scenes for our senior class this year. Thank you, seniors, for trusting us and being your voice. It was definitely an honor. Last but not least, I would like to thank my parents and siblings. My pa, esos para ustedes. Thank you for being my role model and showing me how to always be respectful and responsible as I grow older and shaping me into the person I am today. Los quiero mucho. To my siblings, thank you guys for being my second parents and wanting what's best for me. All the advice and support you've done for me made me into a stronger person today. You four are my best friends forever. I love you. A few last words to my peers. The finale is done. Remember that no one is perfect, and no matter how much we plan, something just won't go the way we plan it to. As hard as it is to swallow a pill, we must move on and adapt to whatever situation we come across. Don't beat yourself up. It'll happen to us all. Remember that what is meant to happen will happen. Everything happens for a reason. Don't forget to love yourself and remind yourself how much you love the person who makes you, you. Like Dr. Sue said, today is your day. You're off to great places. You're off and away. Congrats, class of 2020. Yes, you definitely heard that right one last time. And now I'll introduce you to our 2020 valedictorian, Jessica Ramirez. Good evening, graduates, teachers, parents, and staff. Thank you all for joining us today as we celebrate the class of 2020. First and foremost, I want to thank our amazing counselors and staff who made this virtual graduation possible. We appreciate your dedication to helping us celebrate the end of our senior year. I am so honored to be standing here as this year's valedictorian. Four years ago, when I first set foot on our campus for volleyball tryouts, I had no idea I would be here speaking before you today. I was only 12 at the time, and I vividly remember being intimidated by all the older girls I saw playing on the varsity side of the gym. A lot has changed since that first day at Southgate, though. Like many of us, I have since faced some of the most mentally and physically demanding times of my life. It is these hardships, however, that I have to thank for helping me grow into someone who no longer runs away from challenges, but rather embraces them. I know that a global pandemic isn't exactly what we pictured as we saw ahead to this stage of our lives, but we have no other choice but to face this challenge head on. Remember that there's more to being an adult than the freedom and independence we often crave. We must step up to our responsibilities and educate ourselves about the issues surrounding not only our community, but those of our fellow brothers and sisters. We live in a time where xenophobia, racism, and the abuse of power are not condemned and punished as they should be. Nobody deserves to live in fear because of the color of their skin, sexual orientation, or legal status. This isn't a matter of politics, but it is an issue of basic human rights. Black lives matter today, tomorrow, and always. During this modern age of social media, we are so fortunate to have easy access to knowledge that can help us fight these systematic issues. It is vital that we take advantage of this opportunity to grow into socially aware individuals and advocate for a better future and a true justice system. Be proactive, take action. Don't rely on others to speak out for you, but rather use your own voice to raise awareness and make a change. Those of you who can vote this November, please do so. Sign petitions, protest, make sacrifices. During these unprecedented times, it is more important than ever that you remember where you come from and stand up for those who don't have a voice. Don't allow fear to prevent you from becoming a part of something bigger than yourself, whatever that may be. Many of us are the first in our families to graduate from high school. Many of us will be the first to attend and graduate from college, and for that, we should all be very proud of ourselves. Allow your passions to flourish as you further your knowledge and gain real-world experiences. Always stay true to who you are and never forget to thank the people who have helped you succeed. Maybe it was a teacher you could always count on to have your back, or the best friend whose unconditional love and support pushed you to become the best version of yourself. Many of us are children of immigrants, and although we should not talk about their struggles as our own, I do want to acknowledge them. Papas, verlos a ustedes trabajar tan duro y sacrificar tanto por mí y por mis hermanos es la mayor prueba de amor que me pueden dar. Sin su paciencia, su apoyo y el amor incondicional que siempre me han dado, yo no podría haber llegado a donde estoy. Lo logramos juntos. 
I also want to thank Mr. and Mrs. Corona, whose unwavering support throughout high school encouraged me to pursue my goals and believe in myself even when I was at my lowest. I have never met people more passionate about what they do, and for that, Southgate is very lucky to have them. Ms. Garcia is one of the kindest, funniest, and most caring individuals I have had the honor of learning from. Mrs. Toseda and Ms. Murillo always pushed my boundaries and helped me grow both as a student and as a person. And for that, I am forever grateful. Thank you, Ms. Larga Espada, for inspiring me to pursue my goals through your own enthusiasm for teaching. Coney, thank you for instilling in me the importance of hard work and dedication. And Catherine, if it wasn't for your support and patience throughout these last four years, I know I would not be standing here today. I owe my success to all of you. Don't let the chaos of our world cloud your hopes for a brighter future, and don't let these challenging times keep you from holding on to the great memories we created together over the last four years. We will forever be remembered not as a class cheated by a global pandemic, but as a class with the vision. Class of 2020, you are the future, and I wish you all the best. Thank you. And now, a few words from our salutatorian, Jessica de la Torre. Good evening, everyone. Thank you for joining us today. Although this is not how we expected to celebrate our graduation, the effort and motivation you all have put into participating is amazing. So thank you for making the most out of the situation. Today, we celebrate each other and our accomplishments, not only as students, but as individuals. I'm sure you've all looked back at freshman year and wondered how quickly we have gotten to where we are now. Our high school experience has been defined by countless memorable moments that we have shared with our friends and peers from outings to sleepless nights. However, our experience has not only been defined by these moments, but most importantly by the people involved. We all have, have had family members, friends, teachers, peers, coaches, or counselors that have been instrumental in our academic and personal development. And the reason why we are here today is because of their immense support and guidance. I am extremely grateful to those who have helped me become the person I am today, which is a person I needed when I was younger and is diligent, resilient, and determined. Therefore, thank you to the teachers who believed in my potential and goals and had patience with me, even when I was at my lowest points. I'm especially thankful to Ms. Higgins for providing support, joy, and laughter, to Mrs. Toseda for always being available and listening to my rants, to Mr. Morayla for being encouraging and patient, even when calculus was overwhelming, to Mrs. Mikasa for being an incredible guide in debate and for believing in us debaters, and to Ms. Murillo for helping me realize my strengths. Thank you also to my counselor, Mr. Gallardo, for consistently guiding me and believing in me during all of these years. A special shout out and thank you to the table for being the most encouraging, craziest, and understanding friends. You know who you are, and that includes Daniel and Brian. And lastly, thank you to my family for being present and unconditionally motivating me to achieve my goals, especially Rigo and Joyce, for answering every single question I had and reminding me of my capabilities, and understanding how bittersweet, challenging, and rewarding this experience has been. I appreciate you. Thanks to you all, I have a future to look forward to and one that I can face with confidence. After today, we will face our future, which in our current challenging environment can seem pretty daunting. Regardless, remember to advocate and not remain overshadowed or degraded by anyone who attempts to silence, oppress, minimize or your perspectives or experiences. Firmly express your beliefs in what is just and fair, especially now and continue this persistence throughout your life. As for my fellow first generation college students, I hope you recognize the obstacles you have overcome and how much more is left for you to achieve as you set the example for future generations. As a first generation college student myself, I have had many challenging experiences where I felt overwhelmed by doubt, uncertainty, and lack of motivation. Yet, there have also been moments of pride, joy, and success, but this is just the beginning. And there is still much more in store for us. Regardless of the path you decide to take from this point on, remain confident that only you know what is best for yourself and that you have the potential to achieve all of your goals and aspirations, no matter the magnitude. Remember, there will be times where we will lose motivation or clarity, but this is part of growing into the best version of ourselves we aspire to be. Our senior year evidently took an unexpected and unfortunate turn. Many of us looked forward to all the upcoming senior events and time with our friends, teachers, and advisors. Luckily, we were fortunate enough to have had some great events where we showed our spirit. After all this, we have remained connected and united as we brought this year to an end. I hope we will continue to be as united as we begin our new path and look back at our high school years and reflect on our experience as a, as a RAM, as being one that is valuable and dear to us. Classmates, good luck in your future as you face new experiences. I wish you all health, success, and happiness. Congratulations, class of 2020. Thank you. And I'd like to introduce senior class president, Rebecca Avila.
welcome, Miss. <clears throat> Good evening and welcome, class of 2020. We finally did it. <clears throat> I'd like to thank Mr. Gonzalez, faculty, parents, graduates, and guests all joining us today in our very unique ceremony and for even making this possible given the special circumstances that we are in. It is an absolute honor to be able to speak here today and I'd like to personally thank you all for allowing me to be your senior class president and to be your voice. Graduation day is the day we've always looked forward to and although it may not be exactly how we imagined it to be, the important thing to remember is that we worked hard and we made it. We reached a milestone and a great accomplishment. We will not get discredited for four years worth of hard work. Finishing strong, even through a global pandemic, is not something everybody gets to say, and that is something definitely to be, pr definitely to be proud of. We've grown up together these past four years, and for some even longer. And after today, many of us may never even see each other again, but it is exciting to see what paths and careers you will all follow and choose. My journey as a student here at Southgate High School wasn't always e easy either. There were countless sleepless nights, exams, people I didn't always get along with, and an, an exceeding amount of stress. However, I managed to somehow push through it all, and I'm sure many of you did too. I tried to better my school as much as I could and to the best of my abilities, whether it was through leadership, clubs, journalism, or sports. I always tried to better my community through organized events with the help of magnificent people over the years. And luckily, we were pretty successful. Um, oops, sorry, I lost my place. I'd like to give a special shout out to our senior cabinet, the leadership class, and our amazing vice president, Angel, who helped push, create for, that we helped create, pushed for, and made a lot of these events possible. Our senior year especially, we came in strong and our spirit was unmatchable compared to the other years. We brought back that RAM pride. Considering we only had a handful of events due to our senior year being cut short, we managed to have an incredible Southeast versus Southgate rivalry game, a first annual Senior Pumpkin Patch Day, the revival of Senior Day after six years of it being canceled, a very fun first Junior versus Senior Day, and many more. Not to mention, we would have also brought back Grad Night at Disney after years of cancellation had we gone. But we couldn't have done it without your guys' support and spirit, so thank yourselves as well. I can genuinely say high school was a once in a lifetime experience that I'm eternally grateful for. With that being said, I'm glad we made it to the end and I'm proud of each and every one of you graduating here today. We finally did it, class of 2020. This great journey of mine wouldn't have been possible without the support of my parents, my family, you know, my grandparents, uh, my nana, uh, my sisters, literally everybody, aunts, uncles, cousins, thank you all. I wouldn't be here today if it wasn't for you guys. Um, and to my close friends and my best friend, Denise, my parents especially for putting a roof over my head and for supporting me emotionally and financially. Thank you and I love you both. Some teachers and faculty I'd like to personally thank for always being there for me when I needed them most. You know, whether they pushed me, made me cry, supported me, or just gave me the time of day to listen and help me. So a huge thank you especially to Ms. Murillo, Ms. Callahan, uh, Ms. Huerta, Mr. Martinez, Ms. Kodama, Ms. Lopez, uh, Mrs. Toseda, Mr. Vasquez, Mr. Gonzalez, and the list goes on. I'm so um, grateful for you guys, and you guys have helped shape me into the individual that I am today. And as I wrap things up, I just want to remind everyone that, the graduating, high, that graduating high school is only the beginning. We have so much yet ahead of us. Despite all the madness currently going on around us, we must stick together, support one another, and be the resilient individuals that I know each and every single one of you are. Once again, congratulations, class of 2020. I'd now like to introduce our college counselor, Ms. Corona, Mrs. Corona. Thank you. Good evening. I would like to take a moment to acknowledge all seniors who were honored last week during our senior awards ceremony. They were recognized for their academic achievement their persistence, and also perfect attendance. Their names are listed under each category on our graduation program, and they also received a cord, a medal, or, and or a, a trophy. So to all of them, I just want to say congratulations. I hope you continue to excel in your academics. Thank you.
At this, at this time, I would like to introduce our principal, Mr. Gonzalez. So once again, thank you all for joining us today. I think the hardest part is following up with those great speeches from our children, the future leaders of tomorrow. Los agradezco, padres que estén aquí ahora. Um, me da lástima que no estamos donde debemos de estar en Home Depot Center, Dignity Park, to do this celebration. Lo que sí estoy mirando, I'd like to say just a couple of words in Spanish, is el apoyo de todos los padres. Es muy importante que dicen los, sus hijos que sin el apoyo y el amor de sus padres, uh, no podían estar aquí. Lo, los quiero agradecer que estén aquí con nosotros, uh, que les video, o cuando van a manejar el martes con nosotros, eso es más, la más importancia. So thank you, parents. Gracias. So now my words. This is very, very, very important for me to understand how our children here, we have Jessica going to Pomona Claremont, Jessica also, the other Jessica going to UCSD, Angel going to Grand Canyon, and also Rebecca going to UCLA. It makes me very proud that these young men and young women will be the voices of tomorrow and the leaders of the next generation. What a memorable year. I am both ecstatic and saddened to be delivering this message this evening. I feel my excitement building as we close out the year and get ready for our grad and go. My disappointment stems that we are not at Dignity Center, like I said, honoring your hard work for the last four years. You definitely deserve that memory and that big send-off. We are definitely doing our best to make the last few ceremonies memorable. While we all fight for Black Lives Matter and to end systematic racism, systemic racism, we begin to understand that our voice and actions can show what we believe in. My belief is that Southgate, the class of 2020, has future leaders that will implement the changes needed to impact the world. You truly will inspire and make South, the Southgate community proud. We are all learning about the many injustices during these times. Our mission is to educate ourselves, educate others, and to be empathetic and compassionate as we listen to others in understanding their beliefs. Many of your journeys to college will change your views and understanding in how you see issues that impact you and your community. The beauty of college is your opportunity to be free to choose what you want to educate yourself in and how you will use that knowledge to make a difference in your community and your own life. There is a world outside of the South, city of Southgate and we urge you to explore and learn to see what is out there and to know what your role in life will be. You probably will encounter some type of discrimination, racism, and ignorance as you engage in different experiences and encounters in your lifetime. I hope that your experiences at Southgate High School has prepared you to handle the negative negativity that is out there and be positive for your community. During this pandemic, many of you have persevered in getting to this point. You may have had your parents or guardian lose their job someone contracting COVID, or like I, lost family members to this deadly virus. In my interactions with many of you and hearing stories from staff about the remarkable students we have, I know you have the characteristics to lead, the power to transform, and the drive and the de desire to be successful. This is what makes me excited about your futures. I want to go back to the summer of 2019 when Angel and Rebecca came to see me about making this year special. They wanted to revive the pride. They had many ideas to make sure this year would be memorable, and they sure did. They had, from the first day of school in which their team of Brittany, Matt, Samantha, and other great ASB students decorated the quad in welcoming their friends back to the first event, which was the well-organized senior sunrise. We enjoyed the juniors versus seniors and the battle of entertaining student section madhouse that snuck in the red powder, Angel, you're right, the red powder in beating Southeast. That was very exciting. I don't know if you guys even watched the game. I don't know if you remember the score, but it wasn't very, very good. But we won. 
And I think that was the excitement of it. The senior year truly was going, to, going down for the ages as the most spirited class in the history of Southgate. Then 2020 happened. We lost Kobe and Gianna and seven other, others on that fateful January morning. We closed our school doors on March 13th and began distance learning with Zooms becoming our virtual classrooms. And we began to witness protests for equity and change. But through all of this, we are still here getting ready for you to take the next step towards your future. I am extremely proud of all of your spirit, your enthusiasm, and your persistence. I encourage you to use your voice and actions to be the person who will elicit positive change in the world that needs to continue. I leave you this, continue to be brave, be strong, and be safe, and be the voice of change. As Robert F. Kennedy, former U.S. Attorney General and Senator, an advocate for the civil rights movement, he said, every time we turn our heads the other way, when we see the law flouted, when we tolerate what we know to be wrong, when we close our eyes and ears to the corrupt because we are too busy or too frightened, when we fail to speak up and speak out, we strike a blow against freedom and decency and justice. I am truly honored to be here with all of you tonight. We wish that we were, like I said, at the Dignity Center but these amazing children here on stage and the ones out there, at this moment, if you can go get your cap at least, we will be turning the tassel. No, we won't be able to see you, but we will honor you for your graduation today. So remember this. Remember, once a ram, always a ram. Congratulations, class of 2020. You did it. I would like to now introduce Mr. and Ms. Corona. Are you up here? Ready? Come on up. Hi, so we're gonna be reading your name, we're gonna be reading the names, and uh, we just want, uh, want to congratulate you again, okay? It's an honor to be able to read your names. Cesar Aceves Guerrero. Edgar Acosta. Yaneli Acosta Honors. Cherly Aguilar Urrutia. Araceli Aguilar Honors. Luis Aguilar. Leonardo Aguilera. Laura Aguirre Medina. High honors. Celeste Aguirre. Jamie Alanis. Emmanuel Alaves. High honors. Nicholas Alejandri. Alexander Aleman. High honors. Lorenzo Alvarado Jr. Aileen Alvarado. Eric Alvarez Natalie Alvarez Saul Alvarez Darlene Amador Diana Amaya Francisco Andrade Honors Froilán Arce Martínez High Honors Oscar Arceo Samantha Arellano Honors Erwin Arevalo Jason Armenta Jesús Arredondo Honors 
Marisa Arreola, High Honors. Roberto Arreola. Rodolfo Arteaga. Angel Ávalos Oyarzaban. Alexander Ávila. Brian Ávila. Kate Ávila, Honors. Rebecca Ávila, High Honors. Melody Áviles, High Honors. Marlene Baez Ojeda. Oscar Baez Ojeda. Laura Baena, High Honors. Bianca Bailón, High Honors. Ashley Balareso. Ana Bañuelos, Honors. Natalie Barajas. Brittany Barragan, Honors. Stephanie Barrera, Honors. Edin Barrientos, High Honors. Vanessa Barrios. Samuel Barón, Honors. Santiago Bazán. Denise Beltrán, Honors. Eduardo Beltrán. Ángel Benavides. Axel Benítez, High Honors. Tatiana Berganza, High Honors. Estrella Bermúdez. Brandon Bernal. José Bernal. Kenny Berrios. Brian Blancas, Honors. Wendy Bojorquez. Vanessa Borja Brand Honors. César Borges Torres, Honors. Jorge Brand Honors. Sofía Brizuela, Honors. Nayeli Bustos. Gerardo Cabrera. Stacy Calderón, Honors. Diego Calles, Honors. Sabrina Camel Sonia Campos Orellana Destiny Campos High Honors Michael Campos Luis Canales Cassandra Cárdenas Honors Anisa Cardoso Ariana Carrillo Emily Carrillo, Honors. Gerardo Carrillo, Honors. Christian Casas, High Honors. Nathan Castañeda. Ashley Castellanos, Honors. Diana Castillo. Jamie Castillo, Honors. Zaira Cázares, High Honors. Desiree Ceballos, High Honors. Daniel Cebreros. Eric Ceja, High Honors. Rosaura Celis. Alexa Cervantes Cuevas, Honors. Vanessa Chable Estrella. Ana Chacón. Josiah Chavarria, High Honors. Cristal Chávez Núñez. Brianna Chávez, Honors. Jennifer Chávez, Honors. Joseph Chávez, Honors. Jennifer Chavira, High Honors. Nili Chica, High Honors. Beverly Chica Cabezas, High Honors. Marlene Clemente, High Honors. Sabrina Covarrubias. Angel Colchado. 
Ashley Comparan Honors. Juan Contreras. Elmer Coria. Brian Coronado. Karina Coronado High Honors. Karina Cortez High Honors. Kimberly Cristales Honors. Tania Cruz Chacón Honors. Anthony Cruz. Marcus Davila Honors. Bronisha Davis Honors. Jorge De Aro. Susan De La Cruz. Alejandro De La Torre. Honors. Honors. Angel De La Torre. Jessica De La Torre. High Honors. Sean De Leon Garcia. Honors. Daniela De Leon. Honors. Kevin De Leon. Alejandro del Muro Barajas. Kate del Toro. Esteban Delgado Cerros. High Honors. David Delgado. Honors. Nadia Débora. Adolfo Díaz. Alexis Díaz. Honors. Brianna Donate. Ashley Duran, honors. Eric Duran. Samantha Elias. Desiree Enciso. Christian Escarga Tamayo, honors. Bruno Escarzaga. Delaila Escobar. Paola Escobar, High Honors. Cassandra Espericueta Viera, High Honors. Lee Espino, Honors. Kevin Espinosa, High Honors. Tristan Espinosa. Carla Esquivel, Honors. Elizabeth Esquivez. Francisco Estrada, High Honors. Jackson Estrada. James Estrada, Honors. Susan Estrada. Crystal Everástico. Ja Jocelyn Favela, Honors. Franco Fernández, Honors. Jewel Fernández. Honors. Rosana Fernandez. Brian Figueroa. Richard Figueroa. Jillian Fisher. Honors. Diana Flores Leaños. Alejandro Flores Romero. Gary Flores. Isabel Flores. Jorge Flores, High Honors. Lindsay Flores. Mateo Flores. Emmett Gallan, Honors. Fátima Galindo Mendoza, Honors. Andrew Gallegos, Honors. Daniel Galván Murillo, High Honors. Carlos Gama, High Honors. Ángel Garay. Danny García Membreno, Honors. Emily García Orellana. Ashley Nicole García, High Honors. Beyonce García. Luis García. Rea García. Yatzaret García. Gabriel Garibaldi Jr. Susana Garibaldo, 
honors. Anthony Gentil. Francisca Gil Salmerón. Lisbeth Gil. High honors. Ronnie Girón Jr. Dulce Girón. Andrew Gómez Honors. Ivan Gómez. Jaime Gómez. James Gómez. Jean Gómez. Joel Gómez. Michael Gómez Honors. Javier González. Jeremiah Gonzalez Honors. Jeremiah Gonzalez Birch. Dania Gonzalez Peña. Nora Gonzalez Ramos. Alisa Gonzalez. Ángel Gonzalez Honors. Anthony Gonzalez. Brian Gonzalez, honors. Christopher Gonzalez. Desiree Gonzalez. Frank Gonzalez. Jeremy Gonzalez. Jose Gonzalez. Caitlin Gonzalez, honors. Maribel González Honors Jessica Grande Zavala ya Yahaira Guadarrama Montserrat Guerra Honors Jonathan Guerrero Catherine Guevara Honors Juan Gutiérrez Ayala Adriel Gutierrez, honors. Alexandro Gutierrez, honors. Matthew Aro, honors. Adriana Hernández. Ariana Hernández. Ashley Hernández, honors. Eddie Hernández. Eddie Hernández, high honors. Jasmine Hernández. Marilyn Hernández. Marisa Hernández. Melissa Hernández, high honors. José Herrera Guadarrama. Lauren Herrera Olvera, honors. Hugo Herrera Solórzano. Zaira Igareda, High Honors. Ana Huerta, Honors. David Wizard, High Honors. Allen Hurtado. Lauren Hurtado. Natalie Ibarra. Matthew Isaís. High honors. Michael Isidoro Ortiz. Andrew Isaguirre. Francisco Jara. Jacob Jauregui. High honors. Nathan Jimenez Mariscal. Brandon Jimenez. Edward Jimenez. High honors. Esmeralda Jiménez, High Honors. Alexander Juárez. Marco Landeros, Honors. Aileen Leaño. César Lechuga Contreras. Axel Ledesma. Jonathan Lemus, Honors. Joel León. José Lías. Rachel Limón, Honors. Josué Linares Colindres, on Honors. 
Jordan Lira Honors Giselle Llamas Joel Llamas Herme, Hermes López Arias High Honors Brian López Santa Cruz Brandon López Bojorquez Arturo López Cassandra López High Honors Jair López Jocelyn López José López Peter López High Honors Rubén López High Honors Solana López Valerie López Honors Jaire López Alejandro Luevano Honors Marcus Lugo Liliana Luján Honors Angel Luna Michael Luna Mauricio Machado High Honors Noemi Maciel High Honors Noah Madrigal Honors Víctor Magaña Andrés Magdaleno Honors Brian Maldonado Anthony Manquero Honors Samantha Maravilla High Honors Fabian Mares High Honors Natalie Marín Suárez Honors Exayanara Márquez Rubio Honors Enrique Márquez Honors Devin Martínez Curiel Brittany Martínez Mota Andrew Martinez Angelica Martinez Honors Ariana Martinez Honors Cassandra Martinez Daniel Martinez Daniela Martinez Jordan Martinez Joseph Martinez, High Honors. Ju Juliana Martinez. Lisdeni Martinez. Robert Martinez, High Honors. Ruth Martinez, Honors. Yajaira Martinez, Honors. Abigail Medina, Honors. Alejandro Medina. Alisa Medina, High Honors. Alejandra Mejía, High Honors. Ana Membreno, Honors. Brittany Méndez. Zoe Méndez, Honors. Benjamin Mendoza. Diego Mendoza, Honors. Ilaya Mendoza. Elizabeth Mendoza, High Honors. Javier Mendoza, Honors. Melanie Mendoza, Honors. Santiago Mendoza. Kevin Merida. Victor Merino, Honors. Sonia Michel, High Honors. Angélica Millán, Honors. Brianna Miramontes, Honors. Desiree Miramontes. Aileen Miranda. Edward Miranda. Angel Mojica, Honors. Ashley Mojica, High Honors. Brenda Molina Morgan Brenda Montes High Honors Brian Montes K. 
Kimberly Morales Calderón. Lisbeth Morales Rangel. Joseph Morales. Nicholas Morales. Alondra Moreno. Ashley Morris. Honors. Cyan Moten. Edward Muñiz. Brian Muro. Alexia Naranjo. Honors. Jared Nava. Honors. Perla Nava. High Honors. Cindy Navarro Jacinto. Kevin Núñez. Nikki Nuño. High Honors. Luis Ochoa. Rodolfo Ochoa. Najib Ocon. High Honors. Esduin Orellana. High Honors. Andrew Ornelas. Christopher Ornelas. Freddy Orozco Velázquez. Honors. Fernando Orozco. Heidi Ortega, High Honors. Catherine Ortega, Honors. Daniela Ortiz. Kate Oseguera Gómez. Adrián Pacheco, Honors. Yezer Pacheco. Fernanda Palacios. Gina Palacios. José Palacios. Paul Palacios. Cristian Pantoja. Anthony Partida. Liliana Pasillas. Yesenia Paucar. Honors. Grecia Pavón. Kenny Paz. Brianna Peinado. Jesús Pelayo. Philip Pelayo Honors. Brianna Perales. Alexandria Perez Tapia. Alexis Perez Tapia High Honors. Alejandro Perez. Alexandra Pérez. Diego Pérez, Honors. Giselle Pérez, High Honors. Jessica Pérez, High Honors. Mark Pérez, Honors. Steven Pérez. Daniel Piseño Plasencia. Eduardo Pineda. Odalis Pineda, High Honors. Gabriel Poblete. Anet Portillo Martínez. Rosa María Prieto, Honors. Rubí Prieto. Yareli Pulido Sánchez. Albert Ramírez Alcántar. Honors. Honors. Carlos Ramírez Sánchez, Honors. Cani Ramírez. Gambit Ramírez, Honors. Genaro Ramírez, High Honors. Guillermo Ramírez, Honors. Jessica Ramírez, Honors. High Honors. Leticia Ramírez. Mario Ramírez, Honors. Emily Ramos, Honors. Vanessa Rangel Hernández, High Honors. Wendy Rangel. David Resendiz Tostado, High Honors. Brandon Recio. 
Daphne Renteria, high honors. D Dana, Dana Renteria, honors. Haley Reyes, high honors. Sarai Reyes. Jay Rico, honors. Jesse Rincon, honors. Angel Rivas, honors. Caitlin Rivera. Cassandra Rivera. Christopher Rivera. Jose Rivera. Valeria Rivera, high honors. Jose Rizzo. Da Damien Rodarte Santos. Leslie Rodriguez Esquivel, high honors. Alisa Rodriguez. Brian Rodriguez, honors. Jesús Rodriguez, honors. Juan Rodriguez. Marlene Rodriguez, high honors. Ray Rodriguez. Diana Rolón, honors. Christian Romero. Luis Romero. Cesar Rosales. Crystal Rosales, high honors. Montserrat Rosales, honors. Ricardo Rosales. Omar Rosas González. Alexis Rosas, high honors. Joan Rosas. Alexander Ruano. Angel Rubio Saldaña. Emmanuel Rubio, high honors. Oswaldo Rubio. Erlon Ruiz Alvarado. Brian Ruiz. Eduardo Ruiz, honors. Ivy Rubalcaba Paredes. Ana Saavedra, high honors. Samantha Saavedra, honors. Aaron Salas. Ángel Salazar Sánchez. Brianna Salazar, high honors. Celeste Salazar. Jasmine Sanabi, Sanabia Rios, honors. Steve Sanabria. Anel Sánchez, honors. Christopher Sánchez, honors. Gerardo Sánchez. Jamie Sánchez, high honors. Mauricio Sánchez. Valeria Sánchez, high honors. Germán Sandoval. Jacqueline Sandoval. Manuel Sandoval, honors. Esaí Santana, high honors. Jeffrey Santos Acosta, honors. Marvin Santos Mejía. Armando Santos. Joshua Schwab, honors. Anthony Sebastián. Anthony Segura Arriola. Brian Serrano, high honors. Fernanda Servín Vega. Jonathan Silva. Catherine Silva. Diane Smith. Javier Solís Bañuelos, honors. Alison Solís. Jasmine Soriano Ledesma, high honors. Tiffany Soto Lopez, honors. Alejandrina Soto. Richard Soto. Y 
Hilda Suazo Gregorio, honors. John Sai. Noé Tafoya, honors. Natalia Tapia Duran. Eric Tejeda, honors. Christopher Tello. Erwin Tercero. Kaylin Tista. Rubén Torres Castillo Jr. Johnny Torres. Leslie Torres. Melanie Tobar. Honors. Daniel Trujillo. Vivian Ureña. Raymond Urea. Honors. Cristal Urrutia, honors. Steven Uscanga, honors. Daniel Vais. Miguel Valadez Bañuelos. Jesús Valadez. Leslie Valdez, high honors. Giovanni Valencia, honors. Magali Vargas Quiñones. High honors. Dana Vargas Cota. Erin Vargas. Angelica Vargas. Honors. Marta Vargas. Raquel Vargas. Valerie Vargas. Ana Vargas. Alberto Vázquez. Michelle Vázquez, honors. Savannah Vázquez, honors. Jeff Vázquez, high honors. Omar Vázquez. Citlali Vázquez. Kevin Vela. Henry Velázquez Fuentes, honors. Aileen Velázquez, honors. William Velázquez. Celeste Vélez. Jaylee Vera Rodríguez, high honors. Lucía Verdugo Santos. Brian Verduzco Velasco. Pedro Verduzco. Perla Berlusco. Gabriela Viera. Agustín Villa. Manuel Villalpando. Noelia Villalbazo. Grace Villegas. Honors. Alan Saldívar Pacheco. Alexis Zamora. Catherine Samudio. Robert Sardeneta. Jasmine Sendejas.
we're about to give, begin our tassel turning ceremony. Mr. Gonzalez, it is my privilege and honor to certify to you that each candidate presented on the official graduation list has been confirmed of all the graduation requirements set forth by the state of California and the Los Angeles Unified School Board. I present to you the class of 2020. Thank you, Mr. Sanchez. If you are at home at this time, please put your cap on. So by the authority vested in me as the principal of Southgate High School, the laws of the great state of California, and the policies of the Los Angeles Unified School District, I hereby accept and confirm that the seniors of the class of 2020, whose names have been presented to me and are hereby graduates of Southgate High School. Graduates, at this time, you may move your tassels from the right side of your mortarboard to the left. You are now considered alumni of Southgate High School. At this time, I'd like to present Mr. Roland Santos and Mr. Max Vasquez with a special announcement. Congratulations, our seniors, class of 2020. I'm going to give you guys a round of applause one more time. What an amazing afternoon, evening. What a great time celebrating, guys. But we're not done celebrating, OK? Check it out. We're going to have our drive through Grad and Grow event this Tuesday, 2 PM. Uh, all of the information, the detailed information is posted on our website our Facebook account, Instagram, and our Twitter, guys. Congratulations tonight, but you guys, we get to see you in person Tuesday, 2 p.m. Looking forward to the to Grad and Grow event. I'm gonna have Mr. Vasquez share a little bit more in terms of the things you're gonna bring and where you guys are gonna meet. Congratulations, class of 2020. I'm very happy to be here and just sharing this moment with all of you. So, now that you're done, we're gonna go ahead and finish up with one last event which is gonna be that drive-through graduation that we're calling a grad and go. So, the way you're gonna, this is gonna work, I'm gonna email you, you're gonna get an arrival time, you're gonna be asked to drive up from Firestone, north on state, and make a right onto Ardmore. I will be your checkpoint. What am I gonna look for? I'm gonna look for your cap and gown. Everybody that has their cap and gown has been clear to graduate and is now an alumni. That's your ticket in. Make sure your parents are there with you, your family members that love you. Um, yes, they're welcome to come with us. Please be sure to follow the directions on the sign. So once you're done with that, once you have that ticket in, make sure that you're wearing face masks and that you're protected. Because even though we're happy and we're celebrating, we're still following safety rules because we want to make sure that you guys enjoy the day but are all safe. So again, you're gonna drive north on state, make a ride onto Ardmore, and you're gonna follow the directions of the police officer for Southgate and LAUSDPD. So 
If you have any questions, you know, send me an email. I'm pretty fast at responding. I look forward to seeing you guys on Tuesday. That's going to be July 16th for our Grad and Go Parade slash graduation event. Thank you all. This has been a pleasure. It looks exciting. I'm very happy for all of you. Congratulations again, alumni of Southgate High School. I want to thank all of you for joining us this evening. A uh, special shout out to Mr. Gramajo and his team for such a successful live event. I'd like to thank the parents who are also here. Uh, thank you for joining us. Gracias por uh, atendiendo, asistiendo con nosotros también. The graduates, Ms. Corona, Ms. Hamamoto, Mr. Sanchez, also Mr. Marcelo Martinez. And if I missed anybody putting this together, it was a great event. So thank you once again. Enjoy your evening. Go out and celebrate. Take your pictures, but we'll wait for you Tuesday, uh, and we'll have a very, very special ceremony. Hopefully it's memorable. So congratulations, young um, ladies and young gentlemen. Uh, thank you for, for everything that you have done, and I hope to see you on Tuesday. Remember, once a ram, always a ram.